I am angry. So good. Oh. I just made this for my mum's birthday. Hello, all hit addicts of all various colours and shapes. Welcome back to the Lion's Garden. And I am here back with you once again for having returned from jumping off the world. And guess what time it is? It's that time of the year where I change the font color on my video thumbnails again. You know what that is. It is my birthday. And this is my birthday present for myself. And that is my dog. He's very confused. Look at him. Confusion emanates. Okay, how about let's see. <clears throat> Sexy. Uh, let's see what my 25th solar literature return has actually gotten me this year. Got me knife. <clears throat> one-handed because I wasn't able to put my phone on the coffee cup well I don't know what this is posh it's posh let's do it like that oh look at this no I won't ever be able to can I actually oh yeah I know you're gonna have to go through the horrors together with me I wanted to apologize for not making any videos. I was actually busy with working with my father in construction lately and he turned out to be an absolute fucking dipshit. So I quit my work with him and now I am unemployed but I am receiving good luck actually. So I might be beginning to work as a hairdresser again, and I'm finding some posh salons to work at. Look, we were actually able to do this. Don't mind that this is actually the bottom of the box, because I'm not going to show you my personal details, and I'm way too lazy to remove them. <gasps> Hello there. <laughs> so look what we have over here. Look at this. Catlia. Uh, what's its name? Hod King Sonia, yeah! <laughs> uh, I'll let you figure it out for yourself. Okay, we got one. And what's this? Katlea Holkin Sonia. Aha! And what's this? Katlea Hodkin Sonia. Aha! And what is this? Katlea Hod King Sonia, yeah! What's this? Nothing? No, nothing. No, no, what? What's this? Nothing. More nothing. Go away. I don't like you. So, we have four of the same orchid. Now, shall I unbox them in front of you like this? No. I'm gonna unravel them and we're gonna see if they actually survive the transportation. <laughs> Oh, 
What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. So, as you might suspect from the size of those packages, the orchids I have uh, received are quite big. Uvu, what this? Uh, so yeah, I just got myself some lovely miniature orchids. They have like uh, what thumbnail size? I call them micro orchids. You know, they're like uh, what it's like three and a half centimeters big. They're gonna grow like this, but their blooms are going to be like at least this big because you know I ain't wasting my time with stuff like this. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, I wanted to show you how the orchids actually came in the package. They spent eight days on transportation. They were sent out on Monday. They arrived in Latvia on Saturday and I only just got them uh, today on a Tuesday, I do believe. Yeah, so I just unpackaged them. So they spent like eight, nine days in transportation and yeah. Uh, I ordered them from Orchid Garden. That's my favorite nursery. I always order from it. It is located in Poland. Oh, this is the thumbnail. Oh. No, can we get a better thumbnail? Oh my Jesus. Oh, this is a thumbnail. This is thumbnail material. Okay. No, but like uh, Orchid Garden is my favorite nursery and it never ceases, ceases to impress me. This time they actually included a bonus plant. You know, I received this completely uh, charge-free, so I'm really lucky this time. So yeah, these are... S Can you calm down? Uh, these are some absolutely lovely seedlings. I ordered four because this is a hybrid I am absolutely chuffed about. And as you can see, they came in quite a decent condition, although the medium does smell a little bit like mushrooms. And not a tropical kind. So yeah, uh, where, 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 where was I at? Okay, I'm very excited for this hybrid. It's a primary hybrid. I'm going to show you in a bit. I ordered four. They're quite cheap, of course, because they're seedlings. But they actually look like they're in a state with their roots. that They actually easily manage to, you know, grow up quite fast. Uh, so... So, what did I want to say? So, there are four over here, but I'm going to soon report them and you should see an orchid collection update in the beginning of August where I'm going to tell you what the heck was going on with my collection. By the way, I've had a lot of blooms, including from this crazy bugger, uh, but uh, yeah, they're all gone. <laughs> So yeah, there are four uh, seedlings here, but I actually might end up with having quite a few more. Like here, you can already see that there are more. There are at least two in this pot, which is, I mean, ex I love ordering seedlings. You always get more than just one. So I'm just going to show you what I actually got for myself this time. Add cinnamon to your coffee. It makes it so good. Jesus Christ. So this is the actual orchid itself. I ordered it from Orchid Garden as you can see over here. You can just google this name and it will be taken to this nursery. Make sure to go to the uh, you know this section. So you can go on the shop over here. It's actually kind of hard to manage this website sometimes but yeah I'm very excited about this cross very hyped because it's a primary hybrid between two different genera I'm very into that and as you can see the size of the orchids uh, you know which arrived to me are very accurate to what they actually promised and here are the actual parents themselves Cattleya mossiae it's a huge unifoliate sized uh, uh, classical Victorian corsage type of cattleya which absolutely humongous fluffy fragrant flowers and this is a Lelia halfophila which is a ripiculous Lelia type it, it I wouldn't call it a mini but it's still you know a little bit smaller as all Lelias are than the typical cattleya you get 
and uh, yeah this one has no fragrance but it has very beautiful uh, medium small sized blooms and I'm very excited about uh, what uh, you know offspring are actually going to look like that's the main uh, emphasis on why I ordered multiple of the same because F1 hybrids tend to be, uh, you know, have varied appearances. So I'm very excited to see them grow up in like three to five years and bloom for me. And then I'm going to see all the differences and I'm kind of hoping for some big floofy orangeness. But I might not get it. But yeah, well, definitely you're going to have to stay tuned for how that works out for me in a couple of years. Very, very exciting cross. So that's about all that I wanted to share with you this time. As you can see, I'm still alive. Been arguing with a couple of internet friends lately. Always a good time. Uh, <laughs> I've actually lost a few friends lately because they were just becoming way too, uh, you know, uh, young people. Uh, <laughs> Uh, but yeah, definitely, definitely would recommend ordering from Orchid Garden and stay tuned for more. So yeah. Thank <laughs> you.